And we're talking with Bryn Cummings. Hey, thanks Hi. for joining us. We really no appreciate problem. it. Thanks. So we hear rumor you're going to be on AGT tonight, Tuesday evening. Mm -hmm. And yep. we had some questions about this. <laughs> Can you help us by starting at the beginning? How did you get involved in, in performing on stage? So performing has really just been a thing that I guess it's like come easy. I used to do dance performances. Um, I do a lot of acting like in plays and stuff. And then once I got into magic and ventriloquism though, that's mostly my main stage stuff now. Okay. What did you do to prepare for AGT? And maybe even just walk us through the process of how'd you get on? Um, so basically we um, auditioned. So we had to send in a video um, for like an audition and they approved it so then we had to write a script and then we had to send in a video of the script and then we flew out and then we like filmed and everything so yeah it was a lot of practicing over and over in my living room <laughs> gonna be real was it nerves or anything i mean you, you get on an airplane you're flying out to where hollywood los angeles um so we like actually flew out to la but the actual performance was in pasadena okay which is like 45 minutes away but I mean, honestly, I feel like being nervous didn't really hit me until like literally the act before I went on <laughs> it was like when it hit. That's convenient timing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll ask you another question to tell you a little bit. Tell us a little bit about yourself in a moment. But first off, I mean, AGT, Penn and Teller, you've given a TED talk. Mm -hmm. What's next? What? Where is Bryn going? So we don't know what we're doing next. Right now, we don't have any shows booked because they haven't told us or anything yet, but we don't know. But if we get on live shows, we're going to have to prep for that. But we don't know if we're going to be on lives. So we don't have anything planned for right now. But if I'm on live shows, that would be the next thing if we're on lives. Okay. So on stage, we see you doing magic. I've not seen that. I've seen your ventriloquism on videos, <laughs> which is awesome. I love the woodchuck bit. <laughs> That that is a lot of fun, and I also like the the throwing your voice. With, yeah, yeah, that those are just amazing. <laughs> but tell me, tell us a little bit about yourself. What do you like to do when you're not performing on stage? Um, I mean, honestly, when I'm not performing, I like like hanging out with my friends, of course, like sleepovers. Um, and I mean, I like to write um a lot. Like, I like to write stories on computers. Um, I like anything that like makes you think. I guess. Um, and I do play a ton of instruments as well. So okay, instruments are my thing. What kind well. of music are you listening to? Um, I listen mostly to pop, but yeah, I play trombone, piano, and I'm a percussionist in band, so I play all percussion stuff. Okay, piano and that sort of thing. Yeah, <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> um, anything else that we should be asking you, Bren? Um, I mean, I think that covers it. <laughs> okay. All right. Well. Congratulations on, on doing so well as you've done so far. We look for tons of future success for you and please break a leg.